Oh, welcome back to the. Oh, welcome back to the. DJ Asthma. Oh, welcome back to the. Boom. Oh, welcome back to the. Boom. Oh, welcome back to the. Boom. Boom. Oh, welcome back to the. Boom. Oh, welcome back to the. Boom. 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 Oh, welcome back to the Okay. I can't keep a straight face, dude. I tried my best and I just see dude fucking bouncing like a kid on a on one of those like What? Hey! Hey! On one of those ball things, you hold the handle and you bounce it ball. Uh, Hit bounce. Do not say kid and balls in the same sentence. Kid and ball. You are banned. Brr, brr. Brr. I'm not a speak. Just kids with balls. What about Kid Rock's balls? Kid mm. Rock is a piece of shit. Oh, I know. But Correct. Kid Rock fucking sucks. It's kid and balls in the same sentence without a kid. What about it doesn't Bill have to be. What about Billy the Kid's <laughs> balls? Yeah. Who's Billy the Kid? The like wild western shooter guy. I mean a movie oh. about him. Uh, something <laughs> guns, blazing saddles, bla blazing gun. What is it? <laughs> it's a damn blazing Cowboy saddles, butthole. Is not guns. <laughs> <laughs> something gun, young guns, young guns. You ever seen that movie? Nope. With, uh, <laughs> no, I don't Charlie know. Nobody what knows what you're talking. Who about. Who the fuck is? You're just making shit up now. Young guns. Look at Irish shot a dude. I don't Charlie know what you're Sheen's saying. Charlie Sheen's brother. Emilio Estevez. What? Are you like in the cartel? <laughs> what are we talking about? What are you saying? Charlie Sheen's no real last name is not actually Sheen. It's Esteban. What? It's like his OG no name. No way yeah. that white ass dude's last name is fucking Esteban Zahuglio. What Look is it? <laughs> Emilio Esteban. Charlie Sheen. Well, I, think, I don't know if he like name. officially changed his name to Est or to Sheen, but. Carlos Erlen Estevan. What? I told you. Damn. How did you guys not know no that? No way. Because I, I, I just Sorry, I'm not caught up on my Charlie Sheen <laughs> lore. I just know that right. he likes tiger blood. Yeah. Well, I used to watch yeah, a lot of drug men, so. He, uh, he, why did he change his name? I don't know. He Maybe changed he his name like... in honor of a Catholic archbishop and theologian, Fulton J. Sheen. That's oh. stupid. What? His name used to go harder. <laughs> That's stupid. Yeah, his name went fucking crazy. Now he, he like, you sound like a, a Spanish Civil War general. Yeah. Well, his now he's dad's, just a guy. His dad's name Charlie. Is, is Martin Sheen, so he must have changed his name, too. I think his brother was the Wait, only what? one that didn't change the his name. The whole family just renounced their old name? <laughs> yeah, what is it? They just well, his brother, their old dynasty? his brother, Emilio Estevez, didn't. He kept his, like, original name. Okay, I, I like him why. better. Yeah, I like that has guy better. Does that guy cool? also drink tiger blood? Yeah. No, I think he's, like, the normal. He's, like, the, the white duckling. Ugh. Wow. The yeah. white the duckling? The irony. Yeah. Or the, the normal. What is it called? The ugly duckling? Oh, so you're saying white's normal, huh? Yeah. What's wrong with the brown duckling? Nothing. Or the yellow duckling. Nothing. Or the red no, one. I don't like them. No, I don't red ones. The red ones have been not eradicated. <laughs> not, not since the white Damn, ones. Damn, <laughs> bro. The red ones haven't been around for about a few hundred years. We kind of relocated those ones, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately. Put them all in one pond by themselves, and they don't have to pay taxes on it, though, so. Yeah. You know, a, a taxless <laughs> yeah, they pond. They got little underwater prints. casinos and shit. It's yeah, wild. They <laughs> Come and gamble with bread. Yeah. <laughs> this is dumb. What do ducks, I wonder what ducks eat like when we're not feeding them bread. bread more bread. They make it. They, they've learned to bake it themselves. Oh. <laughs> Where ducks do you think bread came from, idiot? <laughs> <laughs> Who came bread first, is fucking the duck wild. or the bread? Like, to, the, the concept of toast to me is fucking baffling. Some guy just sitting there yeah. made bread. Everyone thought this is this is perfect. Some guy just thought I'm gonna cook it twice. Let's try I'm gonna the see what happens. I gotta take this yeah, even let's, further beyond. Let's see what happens if I put this bitch back in the oven later. Okay, but I the just, first I don't motherfucker to why take that it. and put butter on it. Cool. Oh yeah, that motherfucker was cooking. put a boat rudder on it. That dude, <laughs> boat, boat rudder. <laughs> I wonder if he knew that he was saying boat rudder. He yeah. was saying the shortened version of boat rudder the whole time. <laughs> he just had a <laughs> had stutter. No and we took him the wrong way, and so we started using Bar butter. Brother, Bro Bro Rudder. Bro Rudder. <laughs> Bro Rudder. Same thing with uh, potato chips. Somebody was like, damn, these fries ain't uh, ain't enough. Cook them oh, longer. Yeah. Put them well, back weren't, in they, there. weren't potato chips? I'm, I'm pretty sure potato chips were made out of like a passive aggressive argument. If I remember correctly, I don't know. This might oh, be like bullshit. It was like, out of spice. Tumblr stories. But I'm pretty sure so, that. like, this guy, I don't know if he's a chef or whatever the fuck, but he worked at a restaurant and he was making fries that. and some guy uh, was like, yeah, these these fries are are too fucking thick. 
they're bad. So the oh. chef guy got mad and he just sliced them like super thin to piss this guy off, but then they are actually kind of banging. Huh. But yeah, that could be like harder. that could be like some fucking Tumblr nonsense that isn't actually true. Like how yeah. the people used to always make up just like nonsense stories. But yeah. that's what I've heard. A little birdie told me that story. So <clears throat> you know, take it. That or birdie leave worked it for, for the government it is. though. So I don't know. Yeah, the birdie was a fucking spy. I actually just watched what's his channel name? Oh, I can't remember his channel name, but I wa he had two videos. Uh, I think he's working on a third one of a CIA iceberg of like the shit Ooh. that the CIA has done. Bro, the it, is f it is insane. What Wendigoon? What's that? Who? Is that him? He does a lot of iceberg videos. No. He has like no, black hold hair, on. black beard. Uh, uh, hold on, I'll find his name. I, I think it, I, I, I saw that he was, uh, that was a tag somewhere. I didn't know what the fuck it meant. Oh, yeah, um, it's just a YouTuber. My, my entire like... Most of my YouTube like media consumption is like like murder documentaries, like iceberg videos. I watch a lot of that shit. You white woman, dude! I can't wait oh. for me to get fucking murdered. Somebody break into my house, slaughter me with a fucking butcher knife, just for, just for some white bitch to make a podcast about it in five years. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So uh, his channel was Necessary Information. Is uh, is a channel. Know, yeah. And uh, they're like 45 minute to an hour long videos for part one and part two. And he just like had the iceberg. He presented in a super uh, like interesting way. I really liked it. But uh, yeah, if you ever have just like two hours to kill while you're like doing something else, yeah. it's just wild. like I would try. I would like tune in when like something interesting and then other ones that are boring, like obvious ones like, you know, U.S. supplied a just ton of crack to black it. neighborhoods. Yeah, I mean, I, I just I was making thumbnails and shit, and like the you know the boring obvious ones I'd kind of tune out of. And then there was just like other random ones, like they talked about the like, whatever hundred something ways they tried to kill Castro and failed at all of them. And I was just like, bruh, oh, yeah. some of them are just fucking wild. Like some of them are so like goofy ass Looney Tune type shit, like putting a bomb in his cigar and stuff, and it's still yeah. like nothing worked. <laughs> or like what was the one that actually made me laugh a lot? It was a so uh, Castro used to dive all the time. I think it was I think this one was Castro still, um, but he used to dive all the time off the coast of Cuba and shit. And they the one of their plans was to put an exploding seashell. So like they were gonna paint a Bruh. seashell all pretty and hope that he goes and is like ooh pretty seashell. Like he's just <laughs> some fucking caveman and then they're just gonna blow up the seashell and fucking murder Castro. Like the most bizarre Looney Tunes ass yeah, shit that ever. Is, that was very Acme. Of the, uh, yeah. of, of the ops. Yeah. Of the CIA. <laughs> uh, his ops are just hack me. <laughs> we'll set out a bunch of rakes that you'll step on and they'll hit him in the face. <laughs> yeah, just put 40 rakes outside of Castro's house. Well, he has like <laughs> beef with Wiley e. Coyote and shit. <laughs> just, we'll paint a fake highway yeah. bridge and he'll just run into it with his car and die. That's so dumb. That's <laughs> Some of them weren't hell. that far off. I mean, like an exploding cigar, bro. That's yeah. like actually fucking Looney Tunes. Like, it just insane. It's but it, yeah, it, no, those those videos were wild. Some of the stuff was actually like crazy though. Like, how much money has been funneled through like the drug trade through the CIA and shit is just baffling. Oh yeah, like it's it's bad. Yeah, have but, you been uh, watching? Yeah, those, uh, those are cool videos. Have you been watching Coffeezilla's new stuff? Is like newest? Uh. I've whole, heard that like, name. Uh, I've never. I don't think I've watched anything from that. I person. know him because he was exposing like Logan Paul and Crypto yeah. Bros. So, so right but now I haven't really watched any of his stuff. Right now he's exposing like a um, like a like government uh, like secrets. an investment scam, and it's like it's like upwards of five hundred million dollars scam that he's like outing, Damn. which is kind of scary. Like, I, yeah. I don't think I would do that because it's like a supposedly it's That's a dangerous thing to do. I think supposedly <laughs> yeah. it's connect. I, I can't remember if he said it was connected to the cartel or not, but. They're, oh. Like he's definitely finding out that they're Bro. laundering money like heavily overseas. Yeah, it's wild. It's insane I would that his mental that health point. happened to go poor you know, right around now, and there was three gunshots in his head that he did himself because you know mental health problems and nothing else. Who? Nothing. Just uh, just a lot of those. Oh, a, a, a shocking mm. amount of those where they'd be like. Yeah, he had mental health problems, and he killed himself oh, by shooting himself oh. six times in the head mm. and then hanging himself. I get what you're saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He actually just, just couldn't die. Oh, that's yeah, crazy. Did. Yeah, there's a few wild ones in there. But yeah, that shit's scary. Like, I don't know. There's there's a there's a line where I just wouldn't cross where it's like anything to fuck with, like, mafia or, like, yeah. mob members and shit. Like, I'm just yeah, I can't I'm not about it. I can't remember if he said it. it was or not. But, like, he, it's definitely, like, a uh, it's an investment, like, scam, and it's worth, like, a shit ton. Which is pretty dumb. I mean, that's not surprising. Like, one of the things is, like, so the way they would do it is they would accept money from people to invest, right? 
and when you when the person pays on like the memo they have to write that it's for services so that it's okay. not like it doesn't get like i guess picked up by the by the bank so mm -hmm. it's like how is that not like a massive red flag to anybody like if i was paying an like, investment guy to like invest my money into stuff and he told me hey on the memo put uh this is services this is, this is not yeah, just, investment just services uh -huh. groceries yeah <laughs> okay yeah. sure uh, yeah, here's my ten million dollars investment for groceries. I I, I need a, I need a lot of eggs. I don't know. Uh, um, but yeah, apparently it's just like a huge like uh, pyramid scheme. But I don't know. yeah, I mean I believe yet, so. that. Yeah. There was like there was a few ones that are just like weirdly proven that nobody just like I don't know everybody just sweeps under the rug. Like I, I I'm I'm not exactly one of the people who believes in like a shit ton of conspiracies. Like I'm not fucking a, a yeah, gay either. frog warrior or anything. Um, mm. but like one of them that was like just objectively true was how many warnings the government oh. got about 9/11 is actually like bad. Like it's really? insane. Yeah. So like Ugh. whether you believe, you know, I was gonna that, say like 9/11 is probably attack. the biggest conspiracy that I probably like. That's the one I think uh, most people I don't know. buy There's, into. Yeah, there's. It's just. It's. I don't and know. I don't, I don't. I wouldn't say a hundred percent believe the in it. The moon landing like, one's goofy as fuck. But oh yeah, if you're. That's, that's yeah, like that's a boomer something. thing. Like I don't. Yeah. I don't know if our generation believes that one or not. I don't, well, I mean, people believe the Earth is flat. So it's, people you know. just old yeah. older people. They just like, especially back then when it happened, they just couldn't fathom that we have the technology to do that. But yeah. now, now we literally have satellites that are like eight million miles away from Earth, taking right. pictures of like fucking. Cock and, balls. and shit, like, yeah. Dude, what, don't do what that. What were you going to say about the warnings, though? Yeah, so, like, there was... I think Egypt warned them, like, multiple times about, like, hey, this terrorist organization is giving people flight training, and, like, hey, there's going to be airplanes involved. Hey, New York is involved. Hey, we think it's this date. And these were all warnings that were, like, proven to be given to people in power, and just, they were all like, uh -oh. how could this have happened? <laughs> how could they have who who did this <laughs> like, it almost seems it's, like it's kind of wild it's like they they like wanted it to happen so they could have a reason to go to war yeah it's like george bush couldn't hear because uh -oh. he had his airpods in <laughs> yeah yeah i don't, I don't know if we're getting into i don't even we're think the iphone murky was territories here <laughs> yeah that is that is murky territories but i mean it also isn't that big of like a coincidence where like the golden triangle became kind of useless right around after that because all the uh all the opium the started being grown jangle? in the Middle East. The golden, the golden triangle. So like Laos, uh, Vietnam, and I forget where else. Um, one other country. But uh -huh. it was like the golden triangle. It was where like all the opium was like grown uh, before. Uh, I've before, never heard of that term before, golden triangle. Yeah, before no, I... it started being in the Middle East. But yeah, golden triangle. It's like it was, it was just a ton of drugs were there, basically. It was a big uh, drug trade mm. area. But uh, but yeah, no, right, right around that same time you know, when everything started growing in. Middle East, it's kind of wild. Well, to but, quote uh, a anywho. retard, I know that's brazy. Mm -hmm. That's brazy, that is brazy. Dude. That is absolutely brazy. What about retards? Huh? Why does it smell like something is on fire in my house right now? <clears throat> if I uh, if I if you just see smoke barreling in in a minute and me heading out, <laughs> have you out, ever that's... seen that? <laughs> that just reminded me of that. Why are you clip laughing about... before somebody says <laughs> that? Hey, your property's gonna burn down. <laughs> It Have you ever a, seen that guy brutally die in a fucking house fire? <laughs> no, it was... Uh, Thank you, Twitter. It's like this clip of this uh, this guy that was streaming. I think it was like a kid or something. He was like really young. And he's just streaming. All of a sudden, like, there's just a bunch of fire happening behind him. And he, like, gets up and runs out, and you just see the webcam just, like... You can't even see. It's just fire. That's all you see. I don't know. Well, that's, like... That's like, bad. the way that it's recorded is so funny, though. It's just, like, goofy as hell. I mean, it's bad. Like, he fucking lost his room or house or whatever, but... Like the way it was, the way, <laughs> or yeah. whatever. The way it was, oh, I'm sorry, I love that the way it was or whatever. Is there. Funny. I'll have to show you guys after the. After you show yeah. me now? Because <laughs> yeah, can we watch this kid's live. house burn down to a fucking crisp live? Let me see if I can find it yeah. on YouTube real quick. Live on the podcast. Yeah, but also that that Twitter comment, bro. Why yeah. have I been seeing people get fucking beheaded like once a day yeah. on Twitter? What is going on over there? Oh yeah, that's, what is uh, happening? That for you page is. To quote a retard, I know brazy. I mean, I thought, it, bro, I, I really, I thought comedy was legal, but they just be doing beheadings and shit too. They legalized everything. They brought everything back. Yeah, that, they, literally, it's just live leak now, but with like, 
people oh, yeah. reacting to it as it happens. I like <laughs> that everyone collectively saw that dude get eaten by the shark. Like, everyone got sent that. Oh, yeah, I, to be fair, oh, I saw yeah. that one on Reddit. I did see that uh, one on Reddit before anything. But, uh, yeah, I that was pretty I can't cool. I that video. But, yeah, um, so, like, Aww. with the whole beheading shit, you have to, I'm sure you guys know this by now, but you just have to either block the account or click the three little dots and put, I'm not interested in this. After you do that, like, ten times, it'll go away. I, I, the fact that, that I even have to do that once is I know. just, like, why? Right. It, just, why is it, being it happened to me? To, when the, when the for you tab became a thing, like, that happened to everybody for some reason. Dude, that shit's so ass. I hate that I'm, like, always like on there, like, not knowing. But mine's just like some random Twitter user I don't follow talking about how his oh, fucking yeah, dad's ligma and his GoFundMe, and I'm like, I just, <laughs> yeah. I don't care about your dad's ligma. Yeah, like, my, I just, I'm sorry. I don't know if it's my the way I've trained my for you tab, but I get like a lot of like memes and stuff now. I actually what, you put on like a it. fucking leash. What do you mean you train it? You just He's I don't, you interact with like lot and stuff. interact with tweets you like and stuff, and you get the oh. I have this problem. Mine is TikTok. mine is untrained. Mine shits on rugs and stuff. It's not good. I open not TikTok bad, yeah. and I see like three hyenas like ripping a deer in half, and I'm like, "What? Why?" Damn, I gotta uh, go on TikTok. That, yeah. <laughs> I have never interacted with this content ever, and I, I also I can't saw... get rid of face melt TikTok. People with faces that have been melted. And Why is that even a thing? I don't know, but it's, it's like a you, whole you segment you melt of TikTok. Faces. Oh, it's because you know your face melting. Oh, yeah. I never put that together. They People didn't actually get the fire. They just man. listened to Ascend one too many times. <laughs> <laughs> just once. Right. They only listened to a sin once. That's all yeah. it took. Wow. Uh, you know what? I they listened to the new gay pirate song once. Ooh. Oh, good, yeah. What's it going to be out? Good shout out. Uh, Probably about a week because I'm waiting for the music video to be made. I uh, hope this, that the music same video guy who ass. made. Oh, it's going to be cursed. I told him make it like deep fried <laughs> pirate shit. It's going to be great. <laughs> is it mastered? Makes it mastered? Uh, no, it is not. I, I, I'm just going to work on it around when he gets the video back. And yeah. Just work right. on other shit in the meantime rather than kind of like wait. I. I have unironically been like playing that riff on guitar every time I pick it up. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's a pretty <laughs> solid riff. <laughs> yeah, it's just—it's very piratey. I, I love that, that. Like immediately after hearing that riff, though, we were all like, "Yeah, this is a pirate vibe." <laughs> yeah, it was very pirate vibes for people I don't know who have how no that idea what. Me, I just yeah, I was gonna say we gotta it. give a little bit of context if we're gonna talk about this yeah. at all. Uh, I've been wanting to do a video. I probably I might have talked about it before on here, but where we where we kind of make a song in one hour. And, <laughs> um, <laughs> and oh, uh, man. we got together and didn't do it in one hour. Uh, it took several. Well, in the um, first hour, all we had done was write a zero one riff. Yep. And, <laughs> it took us an hour to do zero one. And, and zero figure 12, out the 13. vibe. And then oh, figure out the 12, vibe. 13. Yeah. yeah uh, okay. And I also had like uh, innumerable tech problems because of Yeah, course, it was bad. Uh, <laughs> um, it was very but, bad. Uh, I think we I think we cranked out something pretty good. I think everybody's it's, gonna like it a lot. It yeah. is ass. That was fun. <laughs> it is absolute ass good. in the best way. I love the yep. intro. It is. The intro when it like it goes from like this like this somber. The like, intro actually goes hard. I know. The, yeah, like this. It sounds like it's gonna end up being like a fucking like a uh, architect song. Gay or pirate song. Like, no, 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 I mean yeah. like the before the pirate riff comes in. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But uh, that'll yeah, be out in about a week on the do YouTube dot com you slash watch the do, the do org. channel. The and, do uh, dot org. Do you actually have a website? I, I we have a non profit organization. No, you don't. No, have you guys you ever don't. looked you up the <laughs> the price of your like name dot com? No, no. Uh, mine's like I can't imagine blog dot com is very expensive. I've looked up my well goons dot com is seven hundred and seventy five thousand fucking dollars, and I don't know why. I don't know who the fuck. Probably because. Probably we ain't worth four nickels and a cigarette, but uh, how do I, I check never, how much? Ever, how do I, I, I check a, how much a website would be? What do I look this? You up just on? type in like your name, like blog.com, and then it, it should be like a domain host will pop up, and then it'll show you the price. Robert. All right, let's find out. But Wait, yeah, so. dude, I remember. I remember. I was looking. I was talking to a, the guy that, not the guy that owns goons.com, this but the guy. This brings me to that, another website. Oh, does it? Oh, it's somebody. Yeah, it's it it's reliable internet access to Western Washington. Oh, no, it's okay. just somebody somebody owns and uses it to redirect then. So you oh. can't you can't buy it. it. Has to be it has to be available on a domain. Available, host. okay. Yeah. Interesting. But you can always get like uh like if you go to like godaddy.com and type in blarg, it'll show you all the all the I like you can get like dot net, dot org, dot whatever. Dot edu? Maybe. <laughs> Actually I don't Sorry, we're gonna I don't know if you can buy dot edu. I, I probably think not. Education. 
Uh, you, uh, you can't buy dot gov. You have to have you have to obviously oh, be like a government. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> Otherwise, everybody would just have fucking dot gov. And, uh, yeah, I think All you right. have to prove to the government that you're an actual pimp fried rice dot gov. Pimp fried rice. I can buy blarg dot com for eighty nine dollars. Oh, this one's taken. I can buy blarg dot online for a dollar thirty two. Yeah, Ooh. most of the dots are like like McNasty dot gg or something is like a penny. For the first what is like GG. I can be blarg.dealer for a thousand dollars. What? A <laughs> thousand dot damn. Dealer. Yeah. Uh let's see. Usually GG is taken by like sixteen dollars. I don't know if GG is taken. Hold on. Let's look up blarg GG. Wad.com. Why is that even recommended? Can we what is the most expensive website? Can I buy Google.com? As far as, far <laughs> as I know. <laughs> Ask Jeeves. As far as, as I know, it's you fucking goons.com. That's crazy. Could, What'd you say? I want to see if you can buy a, a, a variation of Google. Yeah, so I, um, I, when I went to look up goons.com, I got in contact with the person who represents the person who owns goons.com, and I was talking to them, and once I got the price back, I was like, are you fucking serious, dude? Like, I, I said that in the email. I was like, are you fucking serious, dude? And he, and he replied with just, yeah, dot, dot, dot. And, and I, <laughs> I was like, I was like, you... You got to tell this guy that he is like bumped his fucking head thinking that anybody would pay that amount for goons.com. It's not Google. It's not Yahoo. It's not YouTube. It's yeah, just it fucking so goons.com. What is so uh, covetous uh, about Just goons. in case com. anybody really? was curious, you can buy cockandballs.dealer for $1,000 if you want it. I am interested. It sounds like all the dot dealer <laughs> websites. Dealer. Yeah. <laughs> I can dealer, yeah. it's like a black market. I mean, you can also just do cockandballs.online for a dollar thirty. Cockandballs.shop. Yeah. Cockandballs live for two dollars. I want to buy a bunch of dumbass websites. Can we do that for a video? And just all redirect them to your channel. Cockandballs.golf for six dollars. Dot golf. Is there just a dot oh, there, everything? There is dot TV. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Uh, Dot Asia, cockandballs. Dot Asia. You can just own an Asian website. <laughs> Incredible. What will? What will they? What if you just put a slur? I don't want to type it, but like, can you make that a website? Um, probably. <laughs> I don't. I don't feel comfortable typing it. Yeah, I'm but. pretty sure there's a porn website called Dog Nuts or something. <laughs> <laughs> or dog. See if you can buy Dog Nuts. You dog can buy Dognuts.com for seven thousand dollars. Maybe it's not dog nuts. It's dog. Dog nuts dot yoga. I'm gonna type in actual racial slurs. Right. Me and you can buy time, racial. You can buy <laughs> racial slurs dot dealer. You can, argument about losing. <laughs> you, can, you can buy racial slurs dot dealer. Let me guess. It's a thousand dollars, right? Thirteen hundred. Oh my god! Why are all the, why are all the yeah. dot dealer sites so expensive? I wonder why. Racial slurs dot ink. <laughs> You know, we're an incorporated uh, racial slur company. Dude, this it's is like a cereal fucking... brand. <laughs> Why is racial slurs dot dealer the one that's promoted? Uh, it's, it's a lot cheaper crazy. for the first year. It's five thousand dollars the second year. You know what we should do? We should Holy make goon cereal. Shit. And like Why? each piece is like two circles, like. Oh, or it could goon. be the skull, little skulls, little little pieces of like Cheerio. Why is every variation of the goon so fucking expensive? What the hell? I have no idea. I, unless I'm you do like, unless you do like, goons dot fucking. I mean, we have goons store or, or goons shop or something. I think we have both, and I can't yeah, imagine both uh, of yeah, those were seven hundred and eighty grand. We can buy the goons dot ca. Yeah, no, fuck that. Fuck. Yeah, that everything point. is. So, we can buy goons dot kids. Yeah. <laughs> Goonable. Goonable Hey! <laughs> what? Huh? Uh, <laughs> get you goons. You said huh now? You can buy... Why can we buy gangsters.org for $5,000? I don't know. I, I want to find the most expensive... I want to find the most expensive... Just Google one. it. What's the most expensive domain? Probably Google. What? Google. Not for sale. For domain. It can't well, be the most expensive to, if it's not for sale. We can go to active auctions right now. Sixteen thousand for sangyong.com. What the I, hell is a sangyon? I don't know. Cloudplay.com is seventeen grand. Holy moly! This sounds like porn. 
xx99.com is 13 grand. Oh, yeah. Are people money laundering this? Like, what? 5098.com, $28,000. No, this is money what laundering. What the fuck is that? People are actually money laundering. I have no idea. Pew. 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 Ending I soon. Know, Let's see. I on no pimp. I on no pimp. You get it. I want to go by estimated value. I feel like for audio listeners, uh -huh. this is the most boring fucking thing to listen to. We'll be going well, to what, 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 what are people looking at? What do you mean for audio listener? What are people looking at? Gorgeous just, face. As opposed just, to the YouTube look, video look where at, I have my cock right, and taters sorry, out on camera I won't look right at now. expensive Spotify domains anymore. It's, it's genuinely interesting seeing how much people are buying a fucking website name for. I think it's interesting. McNasty yeah. needs a See, sub. McNasty, let me pull up subway surfers for McNasty. Here, let me get Average here. fucking stop. McNasty stop. downer. You know what's funny? No. What? My editor put subway surfers on my last video and I didn't know he did it. There's like a bit where the screen goes black. So he you just put subway surfers. Did it? No, I didn't. I didn't watch through the whole thing. I was like, "That's fine. I'll just fucking post it." <laughs> it's just, oh, I, I kept getting comments of people like, "Why is there subway surfers here?" <laughs> and I went to. It's not even like. It's literally just because like we were playing Siege, I think, or no CS:GO, and the screen just goes black for a little bit. I yeah, think maybe I clicked out of the surfers. game or something, and he just tossed up subway surfers. <laughs> <It's a laughs> I thought you were gonna move. say you see it so often you like can't see it anymore. You like tune oh, it no. out. I know that's no, what no. you were gonna say. Well, I remember one time we made a joke about it. We were joking about, like, like you know how we do editor do this jokes? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And he did it. Uh, I think maybe he took that as a green flag to just do it whenever there's downtime. Editor, put up put up Subway Surfer on the podcast right now. Yeah, for yeah. the bottom like a right. fourth camera that's uh, just Subway yeah, Surfers. Yeah, fourth <laughs> camera of Subway <laughs> Surfers. Watch that get, like, a million fucking views. <laughs> the, the, the retention time is 100% on this podcast. <laughs> Yeah. I mean, that's basically what fucking people on TikTok do. They'll just put, yeah. like, a fucking mass shooting with subway yeah. surfers on in the bottom corner. And I will like, say Ooh. the soap-cutting ones are very satisfying to watch. I, I do don't, like you the soap-cutting I don't really ones. see those. Any, I, mostly I see, like, the Minecraft, like, parkour ones. Especially over, like, Reddit yeah, stories. Minecraft Reddit parkour stuff. is always there. Those are people interesting. Though. Like, I when I'm listening to the Reddit stories, I actually, like, pay attention to the Minecraft parkour. I'm like, wow, how do you do that? Like, kind of impressive. <laughs> Yeah, and you missed the whole wow, story. Maybe, maybe I am the 14-year-old <laughs> yeah. these are intended for. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I haven't yeah. played Minecraft yeah. in a long time. Don't you still play it every once in a while, Blurg? Yeah, I've, I've, I have a series going with uh, Smitty, Puffer, and Grizzy, and it's fucking hell on earth. Really? Is there like a like a premise to it? Like a gag? Like a theme type thing going on? Uh, I think the gag is that I'm a fucking retard, and they're less of a retard. So I, think I like that gag. Literally, it's not like I a mod or anything? Only... It's just regular Minecraft? No, it's just literally regular Minecraft, and then, I don't know, apparently we're supposed to beat Minecraft. I don't know what the fuck beating block game entails. I, I, I don't know anything about the block guy game. guy killed the Ender Dragon. Yeah. Yeah, see, I didn't even know that was a guy. I, I had no idea that was no, even a thing. Like, when everyone, when everyone used to, like, talk about Dream, like, cheating, like, speedrunning, I actually had no idea what the hell they were referring to. Like, I didn't know you could actually beat Minecraft. I genuinely yeah. thought it was just, like, build a funny little house and hope Creeper doesn't, you know, cuck your wife. Didn't so. you speed run Minecraft for a while, McNasty? Yeah, that's how I learned what the whole story of Minecraft was about. There's a story? I mean, it's not, not really a story, but like, I mean, you're There's supposed, like to, rich, you're supposed to go to the Lord. Ender, you're supposed to get the fucking, like, the, the eyes of Ender, and you, they help you find the the area to go get the dragon and then kill the dragon. And then after that, you can still play it after that, it's not like it's the end of the game, but it's like, that's kind of like the goal, I guess, of Minecraft. What's the that's deal the with Lawrence? the... Tall black dudes. What? Why? What? What's their? What's their? Oh, deal? the Ender basketball players. The Endermen. <laughs> yeah. What's the deal with basketball players? <laughs> so, uh, what's the deal with the Endermen? When you kill them, there's a they drop the Ender eyes, which oh, is I what, know that. Which is what you need to to get to the dragon. Yeah. But you're just you're not supposed to look at them. Like if you look at them in the that eyes, they'll come racist. and attack you. Oh, Do okay. not look at basketball Minecraft players in the Minecraft is racist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, why yeah. do they have to make the black guys attack when you make eye contact? <clears throat> there have been millions of black guy jokes compared to Enderman. You know what Minecraft. I don't like about Minecraft speedruns, though, is like it's completely dependent on the your pedophiles. seed and the oh, pedophiles. Yeah. That like the pedophiles. <laughs> it's not like you start up today and like, you know what? I feel like I can get a new PR. You have no idea when you start a Minecraft speedrun yeah, how it's going to go. I don't like that. And they're like, I've seen ones where people like they almost have like a perfect seed, 
but then they they get to the portal and they don't have enough eyes, so they just can't. They just that have to stop. Stupid. Just have to restart. Like there's so many different variables that'll just fuck up your speed run. RNG kind of like I feel like kind of ruins games like that. Like when you're supposed <clears> to be speed running shit. Yeah, but then the people who actually do get it and beat the speed runs, it's like because there's so much RNG in it, it, it prevents people from just speed running all the time and getting it fucking perfect every single time you know yeah but yeah, that's but like then... cool because you get to see like somebody do the most like intricate shit ever yeah you know? you're like but... damn that's insane that they pulled that off but then is world's first like is he the best or the luckiest is my yeah. question true yeah yeah get shit on minecraft speed running community you're mad <laughs> yeah i got i got tired of it after a while it was just <clears> like <throat> well yeah it's block game yeah it was fun though like it, I don't know. It was, I, I felt like it was fun for a while, but I, know, I just got tired of that game. Yeah, that's that's. I mean, that's uh, any fucking game, literally ever. So I don't. <laughs> not RuneScape. <laughs> How are you not tired of RuneScape? I've been playing it since I was twelve, so I think it's I mean, a, a permanent thing in my life at this point. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, I I, I get it. I played fucking Maple Story since two thousand seven, which is actually probably even worse than than uh, RuneScape. Damn. So that's that's valid. It, it's just one of those games where you don't really beat it. There's no, like, actual, like, credits yeah. that roll. So it's like you can kind of just play it forever. Yeah. yeah, that makes sense. And then every time you are at, like, end game, it's just, like, new update or whatever, new something. Yeah. So, like, with those types of games. I mean, They maybe actually not, update the shit out of not... this game. So. Do they really? Yeah. Yeah, they put out That's new crazy. raids, new skills now, um, all kinds of shit, so. Oh. That's impressive. It never dies. It never dies. And then you can be a, a, a giga nerd like me, and you mm -hmm. max out your main account just about. Then you start an Iron Man, where you have to play single player, and you play through it without trading anybody. And then it takes eight times as long to max out again. Damn, that sounds like ass. Yeah. It's actually the best way to play the video game. Really? It's the most satisfying. Yeah, because you're, you're experiencing the game for what it is. Instead yeah, of I guess if you're doing like your own progression and stuff, there's no... like. Yeah. F funding yourself through yourself. It's like the like difference between having access to DoorDash and living out in the forest having to grow and eat your own food. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that ribeye is going to feel a lot better when you killed it with your own yeah, bare hands. Yeah, when you've grown that cow for years. Valid. Ripped that cow's yeah, okay. carcass open with your own hands. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it feels a lot better. Okay. No, I, 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 I get the vibe. It's a weird vibe, but I get it. That's, that's fair. Your mom, dude. <laughs> with hardcore, you do you get bank access? You bank, right? Uh, only Ultimate Iron Man doesn't get uh, bank uh, access. Yeah, so the uh, the, uh, the hard Ultimate Iron Man. Yeah. So there's Iron Man where you just can't trade players. There's Hardcore okay. where you can't trade players, but you also can't die. Otherwise, your account is no longer that status. Then there's oh, Ultimate, what, okay. where you don't even that's what get a they bank. Do on Diablo, right? Where that one dude played Diablo for like oh yeah yeah they have fucking the same kind of thing. seven years and then he and died then while he was AFK shit. or something stupid yeah yeah no fuck that yeah. it's so easy to die in Diablo so I would never do that shit yeah no I th yeah. I think I'd actually just like kill myself in real life it's pretty easy to not die in RuneScape you just <laughs> just don't do anything stupid There's yeah how no do you die in prayers. RuneScape um, like what is even the premise of RuneScape is it just like like uh, what? What? What do you grinding. do? What is an average? What is an average day of? I wake up and I ruin skate. Choose a skill that you want to. Grind there's a lot the actually. Speed. I mean, there's quests. Uh, there's is a lot of uh, it like passive though. Like, is is oh, a lot yeah. of it like yeah. fishing and like that uh -huh. shit where you're actually just yeah. doing nothing? That's why dude literally will play burn. RuneScape while he's recording Siege or something with us. Like, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> okay. Well, I don't. I don't have it on while I while I while I record. Every other uh, time though, like editing this podcast right now, I'm making stamina potions. Uh, okay. Just uh, anything at all, like watching a uh, movie. It's the the room. It doesn't take any on. brain power. No. Yeah. Okay. You're not gonna like trip up a sentence because you're distracted by RuneScape. No. Yeah, that that makes sense. That yeah. checks out. Yeah, there's That's, a lot of uh, AFK stuff. It's like it's weird. It's like I want to play this game, but I don't want to play the game. Like it has to be on at all times, but I don't want to be playing it. Essentially, you, you don't want to actively be doing it. You just want it sitting in the background. Right. Because the the actual okay. grinding of the skills in this game is dog dick on crack. Yeah. Like I it, mean, it, it is yeah. Most horrible. things from that era are probably not great like, to play. Like I'm sitting here mixing potions at the bank. When I was 12, I'd sit here and I'd be like, <laughs> "What a wild loving this shit. <laughs> I was cooking math at 12. At the bank, fucking crafting, <laughs> crafting potions at the bank. It's crazy no though. Thoughts. Like when I was 12, this was entertainment. I'd sit here and just like watch oh, the numbers too, go yeah. up and like like fish for sharks and catherby or whatever. And like now yeah. when I'm now when I'm f almost thirty, I'm like I'd rather kill myself than watch this. 
So, like, do you play it out of nostalgia, or do you play it because you actually like it? Uh, or is bit, it both? A little bit of both. Like, okay, because I know, like, like in my case, Maple Story, I, I fucking hate the game. It's awful. It's, like, the worst pay-to-win nonsense dog shit ever, but I, mm. I play it strictly because of nostalgia. Every time I'm like, fuck that game, I log in, you just hear the little music, and you're just yeah. like, oh, wait. Yeah, RuneScape oh, yeah. isn't necessarily pay-to-win. You can, like, you can, can buy be. gold and, like, Well, the main servers in Maple Story aren't anymore. I should say that. I shouldn't. Uh. Well, if you're Iron Man, if you see an Iron Man, you know that guy, like, earned all of his shit, yeah, you know, you so, because you can't trade, but, yeah. but yeah. a lot of people, there's, like, a huge real-world trading system with, like, the whole country of Venezuela, like, their whole GDP is based off of, like, RuneScape gold, well, it's fucking I, crazy. I do yeah. remember that, I remember there was a money laundering scheme through RuneScape, yeah. there was, it was through RuneScape, and I think, WoW, or something along those lines, not, not League, because that's his skins, right? Mm -hmm. Um, actually, yeah, I don't know shit about. No, League. it might have been Dota too. I can't remember. It was something where you could like trade like skins and shit and stuff as well as I know one of them was RuneScape. But uh, yeah, there was like actual like money laundering and then uh, terrorism. They like oh. terrorists would chat using. Whoa! Like, I did not know about that one. Yeah, yeah using games that. and shit because it was like a lot more encrypted and like nobody uh. like the CIA wouldn't check like your RuneScape DMs. But then obviously they started doing that after some some issues but yeah like it was it was random games like that that they'd also like like my little pony online people would, like terrorists would get together and, and talk about doing terrorist <laughs> things is that why club penguin shut down because like isis was <laughs> isis was just, attacks. the only hundred and something people left on club penguin were just isis members chatting like back and radical forth. jihads and shit <laughs> 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 Damn, that's crazy. I mean, I know I know people have like gone to prison over RuneScape stuff, like uh, yeah. stuff they've said in game. But I've already talked about that on the podcast. Wait, before. really? Yeah, yeah. I there didn't was hear a that. there was a guy who got in some heated argument, as you do on video games, over the ye little yellow text. I don't know if you ever seen it. It's like there's no voice yeah. chat, you know, it's just little yeah, yellow yeah. text. Yeah, yeah. And like he started like he just took it too far, and he started saying like, "Don't come to school tomorrow." Like, I'm gonna shoot up school, oh, like making threats, oh, and like no. The FBI, like, legitimately got involved, and, like, he spent seven years in prison, even though he never Holy actually was shit. going to, like, do anything. It's just, like, I think I they mean, wanted to make an example out of him or something. Yeah, somebody who's, like, unironically saying that probably should be locked up. <laughs> yeah, I think... that issue. I think Maybe he was... Maybe seven years a little aggressive. Yeah, yeah I, I think he was just trying to be, like, you know, edgy, yeah. you know, yeah. but, like, still. So. I mean, didn't that kind of happen with Soup, some guy in his random game? Mm-hmm. Uh... uh and a Gmod fucking lobby or yeah, something. Yeah, Gmod, yeah, said something fucked like that, and then the FBI actually approached Soup about it. Yeah, I think it was something similar to that, but just funny. The fact that there's some the FBI game. member who had to call Soup and ask him questions is hilarious to About me. some cursed Gmod session he was a part of. Yeah. <laughs> That's so fucking wild. That but, is uh, actually brazy. Yeah, so don't make terrorist threats on video games. Brazy really is our that new wasn't word, on. Yeah. No, that's, that's just you guys. I'm making fun of you when I say it. Dude, you know you know what fucking I was with Smitty the other day and he you know what he said, McNasty? What? Bongos. bongos. <laughs> he said bongos. Bongos. I, bongos has I only been a word fucking... for like a week. <laughs> yeah, yeah but it was, it the that problem wildfire. was you said it so much during that one zombie <laughs> session with all of us bongos. that he just like I forget what we were doing, but he just went Bungos. And I was like, bro, oh my no God. you didn't just fucking do that. I'm gonna rip my it's skin just, off and feed it's it It's so my good dad. to say in an accent, bungos. I mean, the one he does like, like and the one that I bungles. find kind of funny is his pimp. I love when he oh, pimp. fucking pimp. 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 Yeah. Pimp. 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 You but you don't even say it like just pimp. Like it's pimp. literally like pimp. 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 <laughs> like, pimp. Yeah, yeah. like it's so fucking aggressive. I feel like you gotta, the thing is to make it funny, you gotta sneak it in in points where you're just not expecting to hear pimp. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's got this down <laughs> to a fucking science. <laughs> yeah, he's got the, he did the fucking <laughs> math for this one. Yeah. Consult the most effective pimp user. So it must be used when too the much, user people is gonna, unacceptable. People are gonna expect the pimp. Yeah, if you yeah. say too much, bro, you said bongos every bongos. other sentence. <laughs> yeah, see, well, yeah, but that's not like bongos. I'm not funny. adding bongos to a sentence. I just think the word sounds funny. I'm not adding. I did, bongos when you said to that sentence, sentence, I just imagine some guy lightly playing bongos over his entire sentence. <laughs> I'm not adding bongos to your sentence, or like a fucking judge <laughs> making somebody play the bongos in jail for the next 35 years because they killed a family of four. <laughs> I'm not adding bongos to your sentence, but you're still going to prison. <laughs> what are you? Is that bongos? Oh, yeah. Bongos. bongos. Yeah, bongos. Look, you have a reason to actually say bongos right now, and you're that not. That dude played a bongos. He played a <laughs> good go, bongos. Yeah, you wake up today, play the bongos, go to bed. <laughs>
That's his old day, huh? Just a lot of bongos. Bongos in bedtime. What is that? Who got the Sounds goofy like a, ass straw sound effect? Monkey type like beat! A... Oh, it is like, oh, it's like a straw, isn't it? Like yeah, a... it's like pulling the straw out of your McDonald's cup. Oh, yeah. I was thinking it was uh, Animal Crossing, but it's more like Donkey Kong. Yeah, that was kind of giving Donkey Kong. Uh, yeah. Bro, I would give anything to live in the Donkey Kong world in the Mario movie. Mm -mm. That show oh, looks yeah. so much fun. Go Kart yeah. Central. When they got to that area, I was like, okay, this is this is where it's Man, at. Yeah, now we're now we're cooking. Yeah, now we're cooking. When the Mario Kart, when the carts came out, I was like, oh shit. Yeah, now we're, we're rocking. We're rocking now. I'm yeah, dude, that down. universe looked like looked like my heaven. Just drive around and fucking T-bone other monkeys all day with no repercussions whatsoever. Yeah, I don't think it gets any better than that. I That's like gotta be peak I until that movie, yeah. I didn't understand that the that them being. Like Mario and Luigi being in a real world and then going into that world was like lore. I didn't. Yeah. I never put the two and two together. I guess. They're just plumbers. What you, They're yeah, just regular guys guy. who like fell into a world of craziness. A plumber. plumber you never hole. thought for a second like why is Mario, Luigi, and Peach the only humans in this world of like creatures and flaming yeah. breathing turtles and? Well, yeah, you're dumb. Just, I mean, <laughs> I guess there's not much of a reason to question like Mario canon. Like, I don't think that I ever played it jumping over a Koopa and thought. Why am I here? What is my like, existence just, in this universe? Like I've never man. had like a, a existential meltdown in the middle of Mario, you know. Yeah. Jumping on yeah, a Koopa's you're not Mario back. Mario correctly. <laughs> I mean, Funny, the Mario that I played the most correctly. was <laughs> Mario 64 and you just spawn into the world. You don't like go yeah, through a Yeah, you come portal. out of a pipe, goof dick. You do? Yeah, yeah goof dick. <laughs> you come, like come you out of a pipe the in the very beginning. You out of a Dude, pipe? you're like oh. a guy who just learned English and is trying to <laughs> swear. Oh, I know. Did I say the right thing? Goof dick? Fucking goofy dick. Your your cussing skills remind me of when I was like... Silly shit. Like oh, eight. Yeah. Like six, was, yeah. Yeah, like I've heard my cousin cussing. You and I'm titty like, munch. You know what, you shit fucker, you mother poop. It's <laughs> like, <laughs> like an Indian listen, guy. Listen. Yeah, no, Indian guys people, don't know how to cuss in English. People have said Bastard! like mother... People have uh, you got a remix, <laughs> man. People have said the same swears forever. Yeah, you got it. You got to change. But I it think up. It, I think that's the case of it's if it's not broke, don't fix it. You know. Mm, My favorite broke. is when you get like frustrated in a game and you're like, "Are you puking out of your tits on my cock?" <laughs> <laughs> like, you, like the most absurd. It's like a word salad. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> a word salad. <laughs> my butt cheeks are leaking. <laughs> Some random. <laughs> I mean, that's based on real events, though. That happens. Yeah, that is yeah. absolutely based on real. They're there like was a coming Reddit from thread. The butt cheeks. Like, there's nipples there on the There was a Reddit thread I saw the other day that, like, reminded me heavily of Dew. Some Aww. dude was like, how do you. No, it was bad. Some Aww. dude is like, how do you get that smell out of your gamer chair? Everyone's like, bro, what? And he's like, you know, every gamer has it, that smell of, like, sweat and poop mixed into your chair. And he's like, my girlfriend's starting to get upset by it. Everyone's like, bro, what are you talking about? That is not a thing that it is you a know, thing. happens. And he's just like, everyone in this thread acting like it doesn't happen to them. It's just so fucking. You're just funny. gaslighting him and thinking getting, that it's not he real. He was getting so pissed about it. Like, he was getting heated that everyone's like, bro, wash your ass. What is wrong with you? Very simple solution to your problem. <laughs> no, my um, my funny. old chair, which I still have, I plan to give it a Viking funeral someday. We'll send it out on a lake and light that shit on fire. But my old poop <laughs> chair, poop I still chair. have it. It's a good I'll backup chair. chair. I like to use no, it for. It's not. Uh, it is because this chair has arms, so I like to like record guitar and stuff in the other chair. Because um, oh, yeah. he's getting the way. But uh, there is a lot of suspicious brown. So like the leather's gone. My ass ate all of it. I don't know where. Yeah, it went, I know the. It didn't appear, I know the leather is gone. It didn't appear on the floor. It, it it dis <laughs> disintegrated. So I think either my ass melted it with it's gas inside of you, or my ass ate it because it was hungry. <laughs> and then there's a lot of suspicious brown on it. And I I don't think I shit, but it's don't say yes, brown. suspicious brown. TSA <laughs> moment number two billion. A lot of suspicious <laughs> brown in my line today. <laughs> Yeah, more than one brown here is a little weird. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah, you, you, maybe it was your Reddit thread. Actually, you know what? No, because I know you wouldn't care about the smell. You would just fester in it. You wouldn't yeah, know, I how do I get rid of it. This. You're not trying to look yeah, for, no. like, ways to get rid of it. You're trying to look I'm, for ways I'm to enhance it. I'm looking for ways to enhance it. Yeah. Well, this guy, yeah, this guy was, like, <laughs> said his girlfriend more. was getting upset. His girlfriend? So, it was that yeah. right? Yeah, which is wild that this guy even landed a girlfriend. If he's got an ass that smells so bad, it leaks onto his chair. Yeah. There's hope for people like me. That's crazy. There is there is somebody out there for all of us, dude. Let's go. If you a bitch and you uh, shit in a chair, hit me up. 
Not getting a lot of DMs. <laughs> yeah. Real Pretty. quiet. Just saying here. bitch. Dude, like adding bitch on top of that just makes it worse. Yeah, just, All right. If, if like, you're... He, like he can do that. Like, you know, they're going to overlook that because he's so cool and awesome and hot. <laughs> what else can I? What do you call them? Honestly, what there's probably a lot of women them? out there that who want you to call them bitch regularly. So yeah. I can't really talk much. All right. If you're I a. Mean... Uh... Okay, can I say that's that? That's a bad word. <laughs> <sighs> that is YouTube no no word, my friend. Really? You can't. Oh, is it? I, I yeah. thought that was a Twitch. Yeah, wow. No, it's Twitch. You can say. Oh no, wait. No, you you other can't way around. You can't, say, yeah, you can't say. You can't. What is he editor? What is he doing? A little yeah. bit of bleep editor. time. Bleepy time. Oh, right maybe now. a lot of bleep time. All bleep. Sorry Big about long, that, buddy. Like a, I have a like hard a hundred plus decibel beep for like twenty seconds. Scary. Like when, when, you, when you just drag it into the timeline and don't adjust the audio at all. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like 2009 YouTube sound effects that are just oh, fucking I would hate goofy. that. Bro, I love that shit. It's so funny. Like, goofy fart sound effect number 20 that was, like, so fucking loud on the timeline, and they mm. didn't adjust it out. Just dragged it in and thought, yeah. I'm a fucking producer. Or do I you remember do when everybody, or when people would put, like, like funny moments YouTubers would put a transition between every clip? And it just oh, like oh, yeah. loud static or like a big whoosh, whoosh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or I got some old videos like that next to your head. Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. Yeah. That was intense. I mean, I love that like the quality of YouTube has gone up so much, but I also hate it because I feel like I would throw. Like, can you imagine how good Soup's channel would have been back then? Like yeah. he was he around a channel back, back then, then, but yeah. like, yeah, I know, but he would like thrive in that environment of just like yeah. shit, of just troll faces shit. and. Yeah, because he's, just, he's so good at just being a little fucking memer. Yeah, yeah, it would have been, it would have been. Yeah, crazy. I remember cutting out like rage face, troll face, and like, like just yeah. the old school memes, and just like inserting God, them as PNGs in my videos and stuff. Like, yeah, if you yeah, were like very deep trolling right. with a little riff on Black Ops, there'd be like a little troll face pop up. <clears throat> yeah, man. Oh man, the good old I days. miss that whole era. Oh. I didn't start YouTube till like 2017, so I didn't, I didn't mm -hmm. get in there till well after like the Rage comics and all that nonsense. I wish I had my old, uh, my old Two Ton Tim content from like who the fuck? What is that? That I've was my, that, that was my first attempt at doing YouTube. Wait, really? I thought your yeah. first attempt was the Ainsley shit. No. What? I didn't know about that. Yeah. So uh, when before, did you do that? Before I even had my channel, and before I even had my current channel. I had a different channel called Two Ton Tim, and it was um, like CSGO. Bro, what funny a good moments. character! That's fucking hilarious. Yeah, because I was like, I was like, you know what? I want to embrace my like fatness, so I'm gonna go by Two Ton Tim. There's fat guy Two Ton. I don't, know. I don't know. Yeah, I just kind of funny. I like that. I like that, that vibe. I liked that each word was three letters, and then it was all T's, triple T. Yeah. So yeah, no, I like that. That's actually pretty pretty clever. Yeah, and then um, yeah, but it was I was at the time I think I was watching a lot of like, Chowboy. A lot of early oh, CSGO man. Child Boy. Mm. So I was really yeah. going for that, like, you know, troll face style. Yeah. Every song is a Kevin McLeod. Yeah. You know, like that type of shit. Yep. Yeah. And just like trolling. Like just anything I could, any content I could get. And it was so bad because I was recording it on like an HP laptop. And at max, I would get like 25 FPS. And if I was anywhere <laughs> near a smoke... I would get like four oh, FPS. Oh man, just <laughs> gone. Yeah, I, I would get a lot of comments. And be like, yep. like the editing in this is really good, but the the frames are just so bad. Like it's hard to watch. And I was, I was like, I can't do anything because I don't cried. have enough money to buy like a, you know, a nice PC. But I ended up getting one, and then that's when I made the McNasty channel. But I, I was making music instead before I actually huh. did the. How long? So how long ago did you do that? The two ton Tim or the music stuff. The uh, two ton Tim. That was probably like. You still have any of those videos um, up? Um, 2015, I think. Oh, okay. No, that's what I'm saying. I, I wish I still had them. I, oh, I don't think just get I, rid of them. I think after McNasty like started blowing up, that's I kind of I think I deleted the channel or I just removed the videos or something. Oh, yeah. that's so lame. Should have just like if anything just. I know. I don't know why I did that. Like, eh. Yeah. I mean, I, probably didn't first, want people finding it because it was cringe. But yeah, my first ever YouTube shit was. Uh, RuneScape content, unironically. I believe. Oh that. yeah, me too. Yeah, like early back in the day. It back damn. Was... So how long have you been making videos then? I, I for some reason I thought you started like around the same time I did. I mean, I, I did a few. Been... I did a few like um, uh, YouTube like I did like a like a, a one to ninety nine tree cutting mm. tutorial wood cutting yeah. back oh. in like two thousand probably two thousand eleven was like the first YouTube video I ever did. I remember you showing me that. Yeah. Yeah. My first time on YouTube was on Smitty's channel, and I think it was 
would have been probably 10 years ago now. Really? Um, it's called I remember Matt's I went back and lesson. watched one of his old videos. I'm like, it does not sound like him at all. No. Like a whole different yeah, person. Bro, you you wouldn't even recognize me when I met him. He he was such a goofy looking little dude back then. Really? Yeah. He did troll but, face uh, stuff too. Like, he, yeah, oh yeah, he did a lot of up. that. Yeah, Impact he, uh, fonts on but, the bottom. But yeah, you can still find that video if you uh, go to Smitty's channel. You can still look up. Uh, I think it's oh, called. I'm pretty sure it's just called shit. Matt's Flying Lesson. Matt's but, Flying. Uh, yeah. Fifteen I like seen years one. ago. Holy shit! 15? That was my Damn. what? My first YouTube video oh, on this really? channel. Oh my god! On Hot. that channel? I'm not gonna say what it is because I don't know if there's anything linked to it that's like links to me now. Yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah. Rune RuneScape content fifteen years ago. Yeah, that's mine crazy. Is, mine is 13 Damn. years ago. My RuneScape channel is still up. What? <laughs> I'm old as cock. Yeah, I mean, uh, uh, some cock, yeah. <laughs> yeah, some cock. Yeah, 231 views for <laughs> what's a 99 woodcutting guide. Holy shit, Lois. Very detailed HD. <laughs> Wait, that's in your title? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, it used to be it used to be very good to brag detailed about. HD. Yeah, you'd brag about like the FPS on the video or something. Oh like yeah, this. I remember that. I remember people used to be like whatever channel, but in ten like Frankie in 1080p or whatever the fuck his channel was. It's like, yeah. damn, bro, oh, that guy's got yeah. a suit. That guy's got a NASA spec PC. 1080p. <laughs> yeah. yeah, back when everything was like 480p. Yep. Or 720 if you were like fucking PewDiePie, who was like the best at the time. And I like that PewDiePie's videos are still in 720. Like, that's fucking hilarious to me. That he really? just never upped it. Yeah. At least last time I watched him. I don't know. It was probably a good year or so ago. But, yeah, last time I watched him, he was still in the oh, 1080p. Yeah, that's, yeah. Yeah, I don't watch him anymore. Which he just is, does vlogs. Japan he's in, like, vlogs. 32K now. I don't know what he's up to anymore, but I always like PewDiePie. He had dogs, has kid, pregnant, Is he retired? Married. He, re he retired from, U from YouTube, but he still does YouTube. It's just, it's not, it's not like the way he used to do it. He doesn't yeah, upload okay, every day. He doesn't do like yeah, reaction. Dude, that was crazy. A long time ago. Yeah, I mean he's he's yeah, made his fucking wild. money. He's yeah. He has a I think he's a kid now or some shit. He, I think yeah. Well, think he does. It's pregnant. not out yet, but he's, oh, yeah. yeah, he is pregnant. Yeah. Just him. And then uh, nobody else <laughs> yeah. in the family. No. Yeah. Yeah. So Just I mean, him. wife and kid. You got. I mean, he, he's made a fuck probably a fuck ton of money. Even oh yeah, and he really doesn't seem to spend it that much. I mean, he has a couple of houses, but like, yeah, even his car. Like, like his, I, I've never seen his Volvo. He's a regular ass car. Yeah, I don't think he lives in. Like, it's a, a well, crazy it's a pretty, mansion. it's a pretty nice Volvo. It's an XC90, I believe, which are not super cheap by any means. But yeah, he definitely doesn't have like nine Lamborghinis and yeah, sixteen McLarens or anything. But yeah, dude, uh, dude definitely made his money from YouTube. That's for sure. I wonder what yeah. the fuck he's gonna do the rest of his life though. Like that's that's my main issue. Like, yeah, but dude, how long can you actually do that? Like, I, I feel like I could go maybe a year being retired before I'd actually lose my mind. Yeah, you need. You have to do to something, do. Yeah, especially being that early. Something. It's like knowing that you're gonna spend the next like what 60, 50 yeah, years he's doing what, like thirty something, thirty two yeah. or some shit. Yeah. Yeah, the human. Yeah, I'm sure he's having fun, human... but still, it's like, don't you? You the human wanna... brain has to have like goals and like things to work towards. Yeah. I'm sure he has lots. Nice. I mean, I know he's been getting jacked. He does like marathons and shit now too. That is so I'm sure he has like a ton of stuff, but like, I'm sure none of that shit takes up like seven hours a day. No, I think he's like, just. I, I mean, that. he's been doing YouTube for a long, long yes, time. Yes, he so. has been doing it a very, very, very long time. So I, maybe he wants to venture into something else. I don't know. Maybe he wants to like. He also might maybe have businesses do, we just don't know about. Yeah, yeah so maybe he just wants to do a job yeah. that's not... I mean, it makes sense, too. Like, if you're owning a business like that, like, don't tell anybody. Like, if it's a yeah, successful business... Yeah, you'd want to be out of the spotlight. Yeah. Especially knowing it's, yeah, it's him sense. and, like, people would come and try and, like... I don't know. Yeah, put the picture of him doing a Hitler salute in a people, Nazi uniform yeah. on yeah, a window. Throw up a PUBG bridge moment, you mm -hmm. know? <laughs> what if, that's what wild if he now he, makes bridges? he came back from that. I oh, mean, I he did seem pretty sincerely sorry, but yeah, he did also call somebody, like, the worst thing you can call somebody on a bridge in PUBG. Right. And that was, like, well into the era where, like, that's 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 a big, big no-no. Like, it wasn't, yeah, like, yeah. wasn't, like, fucking iDubs era of YouTube, where it was right. kind of like, hey, don't say that, come on, be better. Naughty, it was naughty. Like, yeah, it was like, we way past that now, like. Yeah. <laughs> you know, when I yeah. when I first heard that, how nonchalantly he said it 
made me think that he says that like regularly. Oh yeah, yeah. that's why 100%. it came out. That's yeah, that's yeah, like that's why it slipped out. Yeah, yeah, like I want to be honest. I don't think there'd be any point in my life nowadays where I'd accidentally just like yeah, say that either. word. No, like it's just. Like I feel like to accidentally say that you you have to use that outside of that context. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's <laughs> but, like it reminds yeah. me of like I remember being young, and uh, and I was crazy. I remember being young, fucking crazy. I remember oh, that. Wow! <laughs> but uh, like a cuss word would slip out around my parents because I would be cussing yeah. all the time around my friends and like mm. yeah, you know I'd what the fuck or some shit and then like you know my dad would be like well, what'd you say. And that's what that reminded me of. It's like, oh, bro, I'd get belted. <clears throat> oh bit. yeah, especially fuck. Like fuck was always swore, swore on my parents. I remember yeah. I said nah to them instead of no once, and my dad got so pissed. Really? <sighs> yeah, he, I forget what he asked me, but I was like, nah. He's like, what? And I was like, oh fuck. <laughs> you only use the perfect brown dad. I forgot about that. You say N O period. I, f- I forgot about brown dad moment. <laughs> you say negative, sir. Yes. <laughs> and salute me. Yup. Yeah, no, he wasn't a psychopath or anything. I used to hate my grandma. Every single time I said, yeah, my grandma would always correct me. She's like, you mean yes? Bro. I fucking hated bro. that. I want to punch her in her I'd cold. put her in a home on your so grits, fast. Grandma. Oh. Choke on your grits. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'd put grandma in a home real quick. Well, the thing is now I don't talk to my grandma, and so it's no surprise. Oh, yeah, didn't you say your grandma's like a psycho? Yeah, she's, uh, she's pretty fucking crazy. <laughs> Oh, actually, hold on. This is kind of going off our last conversation. Did you, uh, did you guys see the uh, clip of fucking Linus? This was a few weeks ago. Yes. He th- he thought the yes. hard R was oh, yeah. not the N word. He thought it was retard. So, right? And so he's sitting he on the podcast, retard. being like, he's like, yeah, I just casually use hard R's, you know. Not it's not like I used to, you know. I'm trying to. Stop. Yeah, he's like, he's like, I used to always just casually throw out the hard R. Like, he's like, yeah, like not even long ago, like maybe a couple of years ago, I'd use the hard R. And he's like, and I was watching like an episode of American Dad, and they just use a hard R. And the other the co-host is just like, it's like, wait, dude, wait, 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 what? Are you sure? Like, are you sure you're talking about? He's like, yeah, like American Dad. He's like, find me the clip of American Dad saying the hard R. <laughs> and he, he's like looking for it. And shit. And they're just talking. And he's like, wait, 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 wait. You don't mean the racial slur, and bro. It was so fucking funny. Yeah. He, he's that... so like sheltered and nice and just like, yeah, so hidden what from is, the world. <laughs> what is the soft R of retard? Retard. What, what, Special ed. what did he think non hard R meant? You know, like wh- why would it Idiot? even be? So- I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love, like, I yeah, loved watching like R. the soul leave his co-host's body. Oh, he, bro, like, that saw was, the was so to the ground. Yeah, like, he was like, minute. "Are you sure you want to say all this, bro? Like, yeah. why are you just airing out this closet right now?" Yeah, that's fucking hilarious. Yeah, uh, yeah. Linus stays undefeated. He's just—I feel like he's like a weird little goofy uncle on YouTube who just like overcooks a shit out of hamburgers on you know get-togethers and stuff. Yeah, he's uh perfectly yeah. described I've, him. I've been watching that channel for a long fucking time. Same. I like I've always been in IT, like even like before YouTube, yeah. back when I was in like tech school. So like, I would <laughs> any new piece of like equipment Anything? that would come on a phone a fucking computer a piece of like yeah hardware and they'd always cover and i'd be like fuck yeah, yeah. i would love when i would <laughs> oh, search <fuck> search <laughs> for like a new <laughs> graphics card coming out or some shit and he'd be there and he'd be there yeah and when he did, yep, when I he wasn't there shit. i hated that then i'd have I to know, watch I was like, so annoyed when i had to watch somebody else yeah i'd have to watch like frankie p or frank p or some shit i'm like yeah, i don't really want you watched Frank P. Frank P. <laughs> yeah, who the fuck is Frank? I used to. You weirdo. <laughs> who is Frank and why is he, why are you watching him piss? Frank P. Uh, he's just like. Speaking a, of piss, use code like Goons Gamer Subs. By yeah, the way, code, code Goons, goons Gamer Subs. Code Goons. Code Goons. A couple we'll months are our, 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 our flavor will be out, and then you will be drinking. Yeah, it is it a like, couple months? How long? How long till that's out? Do we even know? Yeah, I think uh, I think August. I'm not, I don't not, I don't know about the date, but. I think okay. August is confirmed. Well, in August, you can drink your grandpa. So. Woo! You'll be drinking the shit out of grandpa. The delicious. shit of a grandpa. You Yummy can pour grandpa. all of your bongos and smack it around. Bongos. Bongos. Right. It's almost like saying mangoes, but the other way, mangoes. A little bit. I want mango. Give, mango. Mango. Give me the mango. Give me the bongo. Mango, mango. Mango, bongo. I want to make a bongo out of mangoes. Not even remotely bongo the same mango. thing. You prick. Yeah, not really. You get it. You get it. No, I don't like you get it. That one I don't like. You get it. You get it. I'll get it. I can live with bungos, but you get it. You get it. I know. 
Hey, Gator. What was the other one you did? You said it to me once, because I said it twice in a row on accident, and you ran with it. What was it? To be honest with you. My own wiki. I'm my <laughs> own started, wiki. You started yeah. doing that so much. That was during uh, remember, GTA. Yeah, because I said it twice yeah. in a row on accident, and then just from there you just ran with my it. Just, be honest with you. My own wiki. Be honest with you. <laughs> just, <laughs> we were doing that like that fucking motorcycle heist or some shit. I can't remember. I just remember being like, I'm going to fucking kill this stupid piece of shit. I think the worst era was, here it's Ben. Everyone was involved in that, so that was just kind of funny. Yeah. That was like back in Siege days. That was kind of old. That was Yeah, that was Siege days. Siege days. Siege days. days. I do not miss the Siege days at all. I look back and I'm like, wow, that content was really funny. But then I like remember how often we'd have sessions where we'd all just be fucking miserable sitting there the whole time and are like... God, I wish I could play a different video game since there's 10 trillion other video games. <laughs> yeah, I uh, I remember them fondly, but I know I I don't actually miss them at all. <laughs> I I miss Siege. I don't miss Warzone. I didn't. I wasn't huge on our Warzone phase. I'm kind of. I've always I mean, been down to just play whatever. We had man. some I've good really clips, but I, I just much. hated. I the feel game. like you didn't play Warzone that much. I feel like. Yeah, like, we after Siege you? after Siege I uploaded a lot of Warzone content. I got Did a you? bit of Warzone yeah. too. Yeah. I uploaded I feel like a fuck ton, obviously, but... videos were like Warzone. It was, I don't know, it was a lot of videos. Because huh. we just, like, yeah. completely stopped playing Siege altogether for a long yeah. time. Yeah, because Siege was boo-boo aids for a bit there. Yeah, and then Warzone was kind of just our go-to after that, and then... Yeah. I just, I don't know. I, it's just a game. Yeah, I kind of forgot about that. The game of Warzone Warzone is itself. a tough game to love. Yeah. yeah definitely. Especially since the game ran like dog dick. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it was ass. The game never ran good for me. I love our yeah, I don't know why. I love our game meta right now. I love fucking zombies. Just whatever the fuck. We need to play cards again. I miss cards. It's been a while since cards we did that. Cards is always funny. Love yeah. cards. Um, cards is usually pretty good. CSGO is kind of half and half. I feel like, eh, it's probably like 75 well, Whenever we get our hands on, on CS2, we could play the Oh, yeah, yeah we're going to put the fuck game, out of that. But... I mean, it's going to be the same. It also depends but... on who we got going on for the uh, CS session. Like, if it's somebody that you could tell does not want to play CS, it's like, oh, yeah, yeah. Man. But if the vibe is good, but that's like any game. I mean, if I that it's like... wild that that's the worst complaint about our job too. <laughs> yeah, I think we got a pretty good gig overall. Yeah, yeah. I like games I like, a... like CS though, where there's like a lot of downtime to make jokes. I feel like I feel like that's where yeah. we've always thrived is like when we're able to actually just talk. Because if there's a game where there's like constantly something going on, like that's why I did like Warzone, and for me it was a good segue off siege, just because like. There was a shit ton of downtime, and then when it wasn't mm -hmm. downtime, usually it was like, relatively Chaos. speaking, pretty entertaining. Well, yeah, it was, was like, funny. your 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 car blew up. Three guys have ran out of nowhere and put yeah. claymores down, and there's just fucking RPGs flying. Yeah. We're like, I don't know. It was a little yeah. bit of everything, which I like, because Siege never had funny gameplay. Like, very rarely was yeah, there something the game, funny that oh. happened. The game was just too serious. It was very rare that anything would happen. Like, yeah, like the only times I can think of like. Funny shit is like a funny corpse launch, or like the only clip that stands out to me is when I think it was either super grizzly that went to go throw their cam up to like a uh, window that was like two stories high, and their fucking camera just flew into like space. Like, uh, oh, that's the only shit that. I can remember. Yeah, I remember that one. It made me laugh. I just remember yeah. Soup laughing about it really hard. I just but, like, uh, I don't like when games take up too much of like, I don't like when games don't have that downtime. Uh. Yeah. Like, if they don't have that down, unless we're playing stuff that's, like, you know, second channel funny stuff, like, random fucking screaming chicken game or whatever. Yeah. But, yeah. Like, like as far as, like, a main game, I, I think, I don't know. I, well, I mean, our, st our style of videos has always been commentary-based, not, like, yeah, funny yeah, right. hee-hee-ha-ha -ha gameplay. Right? I think maybe that's why I particularly didn't like Warzone, because I was, uh, for me personally, I know you guys don't really, can't really experience it, because... I mean, I have ADHD, so, like, when I play Warzone, I am constantly, like, focused on the game. Like, I'm trying to yeah. run around, I'm trying well, to get guns, like I'm trying to get stuff. you're also, like, low-key competitive. Yeah, like I do games. have my competitive side, too, so it, I would get frustrated by it. But it was just, like, I would get distracted in that game from the conversation a lot. And with yeah. Siege, I didn't... Because there was so much downtime in Siege, especially with, like, the drone phase and, like, the, the lobbies yeah. before mm -hmm. the game started. There was a lot of yep. time where I didn't have to think at all. Like I could put my the gameplay full... where we would just hold fucking W and exactly, walk into the wall yeah. talking. Yeah. yeah. So. Yeah. But Warzone yeah. for me was uh, it was just it was too a easy lot. to get distracted. 
That's and you guys fair. would get frustrated by that. I remember there was a, a point where like soup would get annoyed because you guys are in the middle of a bit and I'm, I didn't even hear the first half of the bit. So I'm fucking making noises and shit. <laughs> and it's uh, like, yeah. I wasn't doing it on purpose. Activity. It was just, I was so distracted by the game that it was like hard for me to pay attention to multiple things at one time. That's fair. Yeah. Um, is it overtime? It's, yeah. yeah, it's it's five twenty. I got a dip. All right, All right. I've use go. code That's goons. Gotta be the end of the podcast. Use, use code, code goons. goons. Get gamer Mark. subs. Get like gamer Spotify. subs. Like on Spotify. Like on Spotify. Like on Spotify. Like download. 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 Like on Spotify. Download on Spotify. Download. Interact like on with YouTube. this video. Download Comment bangos on this bangos. video. Bangos. Comment bangos. Mangos yeah, or bangos. Bangos. B or M. Bangos. Oh, I almost had a podcast without monkey. Hold on. The people uh, yeah, sure. can't have that. The people monkey? need monkey. There, there you go. go. There you go. All right. Now all right fantastic. Now Somebody's going to have a seizure because me. of that monkey. No, Good. that's all right. Caesar, Caesar salad. Okay. okay. Thanks for listening. Goodbye. All right. I love you. 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 I love you.